hey guys today i'm going to show you the small review of lineage os for redmi 3s and redmi 3s prime and the build is of fadosis let me show you the exact build it i have uh, here it is the build it it is 27 may 2017 and the kernel is default kernel 3.18.48 and the best thing is the android security patch level we have it is of the latest date may 1 2017 of course it is based on android 6.0 and still there are no stable nougat update for redmi 3s and redmi 3s prime so you can enable the developer option by pressing seven times build number and i have already enabled it so in developer options uh, you can do a lot more things like you can enable advanced reboot option and in advanced reboot you can see here if i will reboot there are lots of options i am coming reboot soft reboot recovery and bootloader and there has been root access can be enabled this is the default root access comes with the custom room is disabled and app adb only for apps only and apps adb only you have to patch a smaller patch that will be given in the description below after that you will get root access for apps also you can enable android debugging you can enable multi window mode i am exactly showing multi window mode i have already enabled it and in multi window mode you can see here this is the multi window mode and i can do on a uh, work on a specific layout like a uh, this you can see here I can easily uh, go through any window and that's very important you can see there is no lag it's very butterly smooth ROM and I'm exactly showing how much ROM I have available let me show you the memory it is 1.1 GB even when I have used lot of windows so let me clear all the windows there is no clear all button so I am clearing all one by one so let me show you how much ROM will be available after that oh so many windows were enabled now if I will go in multi window mode let me show you how no recent items and now I am going to show you how much RAM is available here memory let me show you it is 1.1 gb still i don't know how it has not freed yet but uh, it is showing three hours if i will show you for one day if i will show you for 12 hours uh, because i don't generally close the windows it is around 1.6 to 1.8 gb and uh, that is a good ram management second thing the most uh, user asks but what is the battery backup and i can show you this gives you a complete 24 hour battery backup after a moderate to heavy uses so i think this is a good battery backup in the balance mode and if you go in the battery saving mode it can give you more than one day the screen on time is 3 hour 42 minute 49 second and for that the battery is used has been 377 milliampere hour so that's a great thing here other things remaining same as you know the line edges are not so customizable so uh, other things are remaining same and nothing uh, this adaptive brightness light display ambient display everything is same themes you can customize things you can see here the default to uh, themes available notifications you can particular uh, enable app notification you can block notification for the particular app you can filter notification and for security you can do the pattern log you can build log and uh, system profile you can uh, default what you want uh, you can see here other things nothing new just important thing uh, you are seeing this android 7 look and because i have enabled an ife model and exposed is working very smooth 
let me show you this version 87 is enabled and the modules which I have activated are this is Android NFE from that you can enable the Android 7 look and uh, that will give you a nugget feeling and uh, you can enable that so this is Android NFE and other patches other uh, important modules related to YouTube and the system enabler and uh, now the important thing is the Volti E now let me show you the Volti E is available Geo 4G is available so no worry for that and uh, I can show you the call let me show you the call is completed yes you can show yeah. welcome to Geo that means the Volti is working perfect no problem for that and I am feeling that after a lot of time I have get a stable ROM now let me show you the camera you can show here the camera focus is awesome and I have taken a few pics I can show you so my gallery and I will show you the things can see here the camera focus is awesome no problem you can see here look at the outdoor look and the TV playing is also working I cannot show you because it's screen recording and so no problem everything is working fine and you can use it on daily basis let me show you the last thing that is fingerprint and for that I will go to the setting again and lock screen and here the fingerprint has been set this here the fingerprints are working if I will lock this phone and I can enable through this fingerprint so everything is working fine you can use it on daily basis battery backup is awesome voltage is working yeah some users say that there is problem in video call but i use whatsapp video call so no problem for that i can manage by that and the geo reception is also well you can see here the geo reception is also very good in this room there is of course no voltage sign here but uh, no problem I am getting the bolty call no problem for that so everything is work fine if you have any question you can ask me in the description below by the way this is the best ROM I am using since the launch of any custom ROM for Redmi 3s and Redmi 3s Prime thank you very much for seeing my video it was just for your information purpose if you like the video please like thank you Okay, to close the screen recorder and here.